Welcome back, guys. Uh, today I thought I'd take a look at a uh, new email client for Linux. It's also available for Windows and uh, for Mac. Uh, and it's called WMail. Now it's a Gmail and a Google uh, inbox client. And I'm using it, and uh, so far it's working out well. Um, let me bring up the website. Now it's called WMail. Uh, and if you go to, I'll, I'll put the link in the show notes for the website. But if you click on download, you'll see that not only is it available for Mac and Windows, but if you click on the Linux uh, download tab, you'll see that it's available as a deb file, uh, which means it's uh, usable in Debian, it's us usable in Ubuntu. And not only that, but if you're running an Arch-based distribution like I am here, this is OB Revenge. Um, if you're running an Arch-based distro, you can get it right through Yawert. It is available through Yawert. It's called WMail. Uh, the mail client looks like this. Um, I've got a few accounts set up, and it's it's working perfectly but not a, and it's it's a very nice uh, Gmail or Google inbox client and it also puts a little uh, indicator in your system tray as you can see in the lower right it's telling me that I have four unread mail messages and you know it stays out of the way you can bring it up there's a you can put it into into your into your uh, panel like I have here you can see it off on the left there's the um, launcher for WMail, and then on the right in, in the system tray, you've got an indicator, which mine has now gone up to five on red mail. So it's a very nice little uh, program. I, I've been using it for a few days now. No issues at all. It's readily available. As I said, it's available in uh, Arch through Yawert, and it's available as a deb file uh, downloaded, which makes it very easily easily uh, installable in Debian and Ubuntu. So guys, that is it. Just a little short video on WMail. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for stopping by the channel today, and I will see you soon. Take care.